Christmas remake, maybe? From 2006, maybe? Does that sound okay? Um, this one is uh, titled uh, Black Xmas. Xmas. Yeah. So, um, I guess that was uh, uh, okay. That's that's fine and dandy. Yeah. Uh, but let's talk about this one. This one was released on uh, December 25th, 2006, here in the U.S. of A. Yeah. So, yeah, that pissed some people off. Uh, That's good. You know, a lot, a lot of times, you know, here in the U.S., people like to go see movies on Christmas Day, you know, after, after they, uh, Festivities you know, and after they have their family time, then families will go see movies. I mean, I know my family yeah. did that a lot. Yeah. I mean, we went to see the, the Lord of the Ring movies, and, you know, we, we, we had our, our little things that we did, and, it, uh, you know, yeah. a, lot, a lot of movies went on. Yeah. Um, in 2006, I failed to see Black Xmas in the theater. Mm -hmm. uh, I wish I would have. Uh, this one is directed by Glenn Morgan. Glenn Morgan. Yes. Glenn Morgan is primarily known as like a writer. Okay. Um, he was, um, he directed Willard uh, in this. And I think he may have had like some like, uh, like assistant director, maybe some sort of thing with... Final Destination Three, yeah, but um, he he was he was heavily in the, the the he he wrote some episodes of the newer X Files, but he was tied to like the Millennium that that you know kind of was like Chris Carter's like other thing besides X Files. Yeah, once it got canceled, I think they wrapped the actual uh, series yeah. up on uh, on the X Files. Uh, like season seven. Let, let me tell you one thing about Mr. Glenn Morgan. Um, we've actually seen a movie. We buddy watched a movie that he was in. Really? Yes, we have. It was... Uh, Sleepaway? No, it was from 1986. He played a character named Roger in Trig or Treat. Oh! Yes! Okay, okay. So Eddie's friend... Has directed a movie, a remake of Black Christmas, yeah, a, a movie that Black okay. Christmas I don't like, and, and you know that's that's fine. Let's uh, let's see yeah. what Glenn does with this one. Yeah, see. Um, they brought back um, Andrea Martin, who played Phyllis in uh, yeah. Black Christmas. Um, she is uh, playing the head uh, house mother. House mother, yeah. yeah. She's playing the house mother in this. Yeah. Um, we also have Michelle, uh, Trittenberg, Tr Trittenberg, mm -hmm. uh, I, I butchered that name, sorry, Michelle, oh, I, know, dude, yeah. I know you, you love I'm watching the butchering. show, um, and I, I butchered your name, I'm, I'm very sorry, uh, <laughs> but Michelle was from one of my favorite TV shows, Buffy the Vampire Slayer, oh, yeah. she played Dawn. Okay. Um, yeah. After playing no. Dawn, she kind of distanced herself from horror movie, a horror. Uh, and I guess, you know, maybe Glenn just talked her into this one, brought her back to the horror fold, and really? uh, he uh, directed this one with her in there. Yeah. Um, after Willard, uh, Glenn said, Well, I'm going to do this movie, <clears throat> and if this movie fails, I am I'm stepping away from directing. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, this movie fell box. The box office failed, so yeah. he um, he didn't go back into directing. But like I said, you know, he, he has a lot of writing credits. Uh, he wrote uh, uh, Final Destination. Uh, you some of the some of the people in here are actually like you know from Final Destination. You know, one, two, three. Uh, have you ever seen any of the Final Destination movies? Yeah, you know? a couple of them. Okay. Yeah. Um, he he had hands in that. Um, yeah. The executive producer, uh, one of the executive producers on here is uh, Bob Clark. Okay. Uh, he yeah. fully endorsed this movie. Unfortunately, he did die um, a year yeah, later. You know, so. A couple months after this was really? released. Yeah. yeah, okay. Uh, 
Um, he, uh, after it failed so miserably, he was going to, uh, he said, I'm making a Black Christmas 2. He's going to make a, he's going to direct a sequel or have a sequel made to his original mm. Black Christmas, but with his untimely passing, passing yeah. he, uh, was not able to do that. And that it didn't happen. Yeah. Um, so, um... I think he might have, if he had another chance, he might have done better. I mean, it was 1974. I mean, it was a time, maybe, you know, the reason I didn't like it, you know. Mm -hmm. Maybe he would have done a, you know, a really cool job on the second one. I mean, we've already discussed, Bob. Uh, yeah. we, we, we've said we like some of his <laughs> other stuff. Yeah. So, yeah, you know, what... what you we'll know, never know, it, it, we wouldn't have. But yeah. We are going to know what this uh, this remake is like. Oh, yeah. And, you know, then there's another Here's remake. There's hoping for that, yeah. There's another remake coming out this week. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. we'll uh, we'll hopefully get to do a, a buddy watch for you guys on that one. Yeah. Um, but without any further ado, unless you want to chime in here on this movie, um, I, I, I think it's safe to say... This is a first time watch for both of us. Yeah, I've never seen yeah, this. I've, I've never seen this one either. Um, we we are watching the DVD release of this. Um, and Dimension Films uh, released this. Um, well, we will see you on the couch. Yeah, man, so I'm already liking this one better yeah. so far. It gives us some, what we want when we watch yeah. a slasher. Yeah, dude. Insane Asylum nuts. <laughs> you know, crazy dudes and yeah. shit. Pretty women. Sex. Yeah, oh, so I... Okay, yeah, she's watching. Wow. Yeah, I'm already enjoying this. So, the guy that's playing Billy, he has, like, jaundice real bad. Mm -hmm. Or not the guy that's playing. Billy has jaundice real bad. Mm -hmm. And so that's like why his like skin's all yellowed and stuff. Yeah. I think that's a, that's a pretty cool thing. Yeah, it is cool, isn't it? Another one bites dust. Oh, shit. What's going on? Oh! Oh, oh man. Oh, he ripped oh, her fucking eyeball out and squeezed oh, it. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> that was great. Oh man. So what what's going on? So we're already having killing at the uh the sorority house. Yeah. But he just broke out. So hmm. Maybe it wasn't him, it was someone he's gonna get the blame for it. Maybe. Aww. What a sweet gift. A glass unicorn. Wasn't uh, that the unicorn that uh uh killed um Margot Kidder? In the original, yeah. I think it was. Yeah, I think it was. Man. I'd imagine you that know. one's going to get put to good use. Yeah, you know it's going to put to use. Uh, give somebody a unicorn yes. for Christmas. A big sharp, with a sharp ass horn on it. Oh, so what is he, 12 here? If he was born in 70. Yeah, it's 82 now. Yeah. The fuck? Is that the mom? Man, this family's weird, dude. Mm -hmm. And just like most things, um, music is an important part of Christmas for me. It's, uh, yeah. it's right up there with family and yeah, you know, me too. Stuff like that, you know. Yeah, me too. It's safe to say music's a lot of part of our lives. <laughs> yeah, every yeah. day. So when you take music and you take uh, Christmas, what would you say your top five? Christmas songs are. Uh, uh, let's see. This is no particular order. Uh, just gonna throw them out as they come. Uh, Ramones. Uh, Merry Christmas. Don't want to fight tonight. Uh, Diamond. No gifts. For, no presents for Christmas. I'll go ahead and throw Jingle Bell Rock, the traditional, in there. That was, that's okay. a, uh, I love that song. Just the traditional. I always have for some reason. Uh, f it just makes me happy. Uh, four would be, uh, let's see, Christmas and Hollis by Run DMC. I love that song. Yeah. It's a badass jam, dude. I love it scratching <laughs> it, yeah. Uh, number five would be uh, Easy E, Merry Motherfucking Christmas. Something like, I love that, dude. Okay. Yeah. 
King Dom and No Presents for Christmas. Uh, Nitro, Johnny died at Christmas. Every Mother's Nightmare won't be home for Christmas. Yeah. Um, Still Panther, Sexy Santa. Mm -hmm. And, um... Oh! Um... I mean, there's so many good ones. Yeah, there to is. Narrowing it down to that last one that just... I would, I would say probably Wednesday 13, uh, yeah. Very by Christmas. Yeah. I love, like, ACDC, Mistress for Christmas. I yeah. love that song. So fun. Uh, ICP, yeah. Santa's a, uh, 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 Santa a fat bitch. Bitch, yeah. I, I love uh, rap songs and Christmas rap, dude. Uh, oh, man, like... I see P, they're great, man. Oh, Jesus. I, and this would have to go in my top five because this song gets played every Christmas morning and has since, like, 97. Um, Red Water by Topo Negative. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's a good one, too. Where the fuck did that puke come from? That I mean, not that drunk. I didn't like it. I loved it. That was a great one, man. But, but what the... It's like Christmas spirit. She mm -hmm. just got drunk and shit and said... You know, we've done that a few times. Oh, right? yeah, yeah. Old Goldschlager shit. Back yeah. in our youngin' days. That shit was evil, man. Dude, I don't, I don't think I've drank enough to puke for like... Oh, man, I haven't in a long time. It's, it's been... Yeah. Well, four years, I, I keep, think? I can't much drink hard liquor anymore, man. Like, the hangover's too damn bad, you know? Like, now that I'm older and all. But, yeah, I haven't drank enough to puke forever. Yeah. So, what's the situation about the name of the movie? Because if you noticed, like, it actually, the title card that comes up says Black Christmas. But then, the, like, the Blu-ray. says Black I mean, Xmas. Well, yeah. the DVD yeah. cover art says Black Xmas. And then, like. I don't know. I don't know. That's what, oh, more puke. Mm-hmm. So that chick there is David Cassidy's uh, daughter. Daughter, yeah, dude, she's pretty. And that dude there is like, uh, he's like in like American Horror Story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some stuff. Yeah, man, this is a good cast. The house mother's doing really, really cool job, man. Mm -hmm. Didn't he say it was uh, what's her name returning? Uh, well, that's the the actress that played Phyllis. Yeah, yeah. Um, playing the house mother. Yeah, She's playing the damage. house mother. Not the same character, yeah. obviously. Uh, yeah. I think this uh, chick here that's looking for her sister. I think that is the chick that Glenn Morgan's married to. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see some nudity. Oh, there's an eyeball. <laughs> Peeping Tom. Yeah. There's little eye holes all over this I place, know, man. Little peep holes and shit. I just don't understand why this one doesn't get enough love. I because, know, right? I mean, this has been really good so far. Yeah. It's I like it better than original. Awesome, awesome kills. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah, awesome kills in this. Holy shit, dude. Uh, the icicle falling down and killing yeah, her was, was fucking kill. amazing. I kill. love it. It was some awesome kills. Dude, this man, this movie has a lot of good kills in it. No. No. We're talking about, like, crying fucking in movies. Man. Yeah. I, I don't, I mean, I have cried in movies. Trust me. I don't think I've ever cried in a horror movie. As a matter of fact, I've cried at watching trailers. Really? Yes. But like, horror movies don't make me cry. Oh! Son of a bitch. Oh, God! Damn. So, did I miss the subplot of the obsession with the eyeballs? I, I mean, not that I'm complaining. I think it's been amazing. But, uh, like, he has eyeballs as ornaments, and he's eating Ooh. eyeballs. Put her head on top of the tree, look. Yes, it's so fucking beautiful. Oh! Oh, my God. Right. Oh, God. <laughs> she twisted. Yes. More pain. And Glenn uh, Morgan must love some uh, Eyeball Fulci shit. stuff, man. Yeah. 
And that was Black Christmas, also known as Black Xmas, from 2006. Mm. The remake, remake of the Black Christmas from 74. Yeah. Um, I enjoyed this one, man. Oh, I did too. The it was great. kills. Hey, I had, had some great kills. Uh, had some intense moments. Great action. Yeah, some uh, really good action. Yeah, yeah. Um... The the DVD wasn't bad. It looked good for you know hell as, as a DVD. It, it looked pretty good. Yeah. Um, uh, it has uh, some extras on it, uh, a couple of deleted scenes, alternate endings, um, and then I believe two um, two uh, uh, documentary type things, twenty yeah, thirty was, minute documentaries. Um, I would love to see a Blu-ray come out for this. Yeah, not you know. I, I just think they could do a lot with it. Yeah. Um, I don't understand why people don't like this. I don't understand yeah. why it was a failure. Um, as a matter of fact, I mean, I mean, it doubled its money uh, worldwide, or you know. Yeah, but, I heard a lot about it. What's it like in the horror community? Is it cult classic? Uh, I don't even know. It's I mean, Black Christmas is a cult classic. Mm -hmm. This is not considered a cult classic, yeah. and. Well, yeah. it's 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 good. Great I movie. really liked it. Me too. Um, what did you guys feel? Did you, have you seen Black Christmas uh, remake? Um, Black Xmas. Um, what did what did you think of it? Um, yeah, man. It uh, it was pleasantly surprisingly good. It was. I wasn't expecting that going into it. I was like, eh, maybe it'll be okay. I hope it's mm -hmm. better than. But damn, you know, in the first. 10, 15 minutes, I'm like, man, this is going to be a good movie. Yeah, yeah. They got the same asylum. They got, you know, the damn killing you already going oh, on yeah. and oh, shit. Yeah. You it, know? It, it, it definitely had uh, it had the staples there. It had, had, had what we like in our horror. I, I believe there is a, a German edition Blu-ray that has, like, the European cut and the U.S. cut. Oh, wow, that's cool. Um, but That'd be cool to have. as of right now, I don't have a region-free play. Blu-ray player. Yeah. I got a region free DVD player. Yeah. Um, and I and I don't know. I mean, this looks fine, y'all. It's just I want I want more extras. I want Scream Factory to get a hold of it and just give us the sweetness. Mm. Give it to us. Um, also, also want Glenn Morgan to direct some more movies. Yeah. I mean, sir, I am so, so sad that this movie is considered a failure. It made you not want to direct movies Rain again. Me, man. I think you did a great job. I really do. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Yes, I did too. Um, I, I, I hope we enjoy the 2019 remake um, that is coming yeah, out. Yeah. Um, We've been doing this, what, four months now? Yep, we started this August. in August. Yeah, man, and I'm just, you know, just let's say, man, you know, I'm having a ball with it, dude. Like, yeah, uh, me too, me too. I'm glad, you know, you talked me into this, man. Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for doing that. Thanks for I mean, coming into it, man. Thanks it's, for. It's made, you know, like, it's made me, it's, it's rekindled some passion in me, you know, and, mm -hmm. and for creativity and stuff, and yeah, and uh, I've gotten in touch with old friends. I've made new friends out there on YouTube, man, and uh, I'm just really enjoying it, man. I'm looking forward to, you know, doing more, and then you know what's coming up in the new year, man. You know. I just wanted to say that, man. So thank you guys, man. Much love out, you know. Cool, cool, man. Uh, and I, 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 I second your thanks to these people, and yeah, I, I, I thank you for doing this with me. Oh yeah, man. It, it, no. If it was for me to do alone, I probably wouldn't have done it. Yeah, man, I wouldn't so. rather do it with anybody else, man. So. It's, it's really, you know, lit a fire under me, man. You know. And yeah, and and I understand about that creative outlet, man. You yeah, know, I mean, yeah. we've been winning bands and writing and did yeah. we do all this stuff for years and years yeah you know? yeah and this is just our our next uh our yeah. next thing yeah know? man uh i had fun at it. I, with it uh i hope you guys enjoy watching us yeah uh, we're just gonna get better try to get better you yep, know that's that's what we're gonna try to do we're trying to do some better lighting in here uh i know the lighting it's horrible um and we got shadows coming this way <laughs> and well, we try not to, but it's just, uh, you know, yeah. with, with this uh, new year, you know, things are going to get better. We're going to, we're going to get this shit. Oh, yeah. Uh, get it going. But, uh, thank you yeah, for coming out definitely. here and watching this. 
and uh happy always. new year Merry christmas happy new yes year. Uh, uh i'm hoping you guys have got all your shopping done you know hope you get that done back in november <laughs> i mean good god you don't want to yeah. go to the mall at the last minute yeah. that's for sure i uh, hope you're enjoying some christmas movies i uh, hope you've uh you've uh watched santa slay Survive um, Black Friday. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, and always stay spooky. Yeah. Horror buddies.